Hey guys, hope you're all doing okay. Welcome back to my channel. So I was asking about different fashion content that you'd really like and so many people came back saying just a bit more, well anything that's not loungewear really. <laughs> <laughs> so like spring outfits, things that you can wear that are still comfortable, still casual, but just not leggings or loungewear. So I thought, right, okay, jeans. Now when you say jeans, that doesn't make you think comfort, does it? But mum jeans. So mum jeans is not something I wear a lot. I bought a pair last year which I loved, but they were sadly too big for me in the end after I did my challenge, so I got rid of them. And I have bought some new pairs to try. Now with mum jeans, it's quite hard to buy that sort of thing online, isn't it? So I thought, I'll tell you what, I'll get a few different styles, all from River Island, these particular ones are. This is going to be a River Island haul. And I'll try them on, and I'll give you my feedback, and I'll let you know which ones I think are the nicest, but also it'd be really interesting to see what you think is the nicest as well. Because very often, what you see on yourself versus what other people might think can be completely different. <laughs> so I'll be interested to see your thoughts as well. So carry on watching i'm gonna try a few different styles on and i'll let you know what i think oh my god i love them these are so so nice <laughs> okay so the first ones i'm gonna show you are carry high rise mum jeans so i'm just reading it from here to make sure i tell you all of the information these are the dark denim i'll link them all down below um they're size eight they are 42 pounds and what they've got is like a high rise mum jean style but what i am loving loving about these is that they're sculpt jeans so they're made from an innovative multi-stretch denim and they've been designed with sculpting seeming to enhance your shape and natural curves so I'm just going to team all of the pairs of jeans with the same little t-shirt that I've had for ages from Topshop just to kind of give you like a, an overall canvas of what it looks like and at the end I'll show you how I actually style this outfit. So this is the number one pair that I first tried on so I'm going to call them number one, number two, number three etc. These have got quite big rips on the knees, which is cool. Um, I absolutely love the length. I love the fact that they've got the turn up as well. I think when you're wearing trainers and stuff in the spring, or you know, if you're a mum and you're running around in trainers a lot, this sort of look looks really, really good with trainers. Um, I'll just turn around and show you the back. So the fit is absolutely bang on. I have never, ever been a size eight in jeans. <laughs> And I only ever wear skinny jeans. So it's really strange seeing myself in this sort of style. But I actually think it's really cool. And I think it's quite a youthful look as well. I don't think this sort of outfit has got any age limit on it. Personally, I'm sure there'll be people that disagree. But I feel comfortable. And that is the main thing with fashion. As long as you feel comfortable and it makes you feel good, that is the most important thing. So I really, really, really like this pair. I, I just don't know how I'm going to be able to choose. So this has got quite a few rips in. Little rip on the bum, on the pocket as well. Or not necessarily a rip, but more like a frayed look. Um, and yeah, just a perfect fit. I love that it's high rise as well. Anything that comes up quite high is so flattering. This would look really nice with a bodysuit as well. So let's show you the next pair. I like this pair as well. <laughs> I just don't know how I'm going to be able to choose. So this is just a light pair of the same sort of style with no rips at all. So I'm not sure which you prefer. It all just depends on your personal taste, really. Um, I think the fact that they're a nice light colour is actually really cool. I haven't got any jeans this colour. And I just, do you know the thing that's making me like really surprised is how much i do like this style but also how much more comfortable they are than skinny jeans like i i live in skinny jeans i've worn skinny jeans since i lost weight i don't know 20 years ago um and these are just more comfortable so i don't know i don't know why i've not been wearing them sooner <laughs> it's like a revelation uh, but yeah i really like that pet as well what do you think they remind me of like you know when you go to the beach and you want to go you want to go in the sea so you roll your jeans up <laughs> i feel a little bit like that but with a really cute pair of trainers which i'll show you later um and a really nice like beige jacket and i have got a perfect one for you uh and yeah i think i think i'm really into these i like them 
Right, let's try the next pair on. So just to say, those last ones, they are gonna be cord number two, the plain light blue. And um, interestingly, they were 40 pounds, whereas the others were 42. So yeah, just slightly cheaper without the holes for some reason. Um, all of them the same size, size A in regular length. So this next pair are the most distressed pair. So these ones are more of a darker blue. And as well, what's quite fascinating, and this is the thing with jeans, isn't it, is these are the most snug. So even though they're from the exact same range, so these are all carry high-rise jeans, these ones do feel a little bit more snug. So this is the thing with jeans, isn't it? You kind of do need to try them on, which is why I know people find it tricky to order online. So these ones I also really, really like, but they're a lot more distressed. But I just really like the colour, and I just think they look... I just, I don't know, I just really like them. I'm in shock. I'm in shock. So yeah, nice and high rise again. And I think, yeah, they fit good. They're nice and tight on the bum, really comfy. I can bend in them, I can play with the boys. So yeah, I do, I really like these. So these are number three. Let's show you number four. Okay, so number four, I class more as a medium blue, but these are not quite as distressed as the others. So these have just got real subtle little spots of like frays. So if you prefer that to like a full on ripped look, then these are gonna be more for you. Um, what you'll see when I walk backwards as well, the turn up is actually frayed. So I'd say, I'd say these are the most comfortable, but I don't know if I like the look of them. Let me know what you think. So this is the final, pair and then I'm going to show you the coat and um, probably what shoes I'd wear or actually I've also got a cardigan that I might show you too so I'm not sure don't know don't they, they feel the nicest they probably fit me the best out of all of them but I'm not 100% sure that they're quite as flattering I don't know I guess I'm just so used to wearing like tighter fitting jeans I'm not used to wearing like loose jeans so they feel a bit funny hmm not sure what do you think okay so i've got a couple of different things that i'll probably wear with this type of outfit it's not warm enough yet to be able to go out and just have a short sleeve t-shirt on so i got this top shop cardigan i got it an extra small because for me personally, I don't like oversized stuff. I think it looks gorgeous on other people, but I just don't like it. So it's got a hood and it is extra small. It was 45.99. And it is, like I say, it's from Topshop. It's absolutely gorgeous material. Um, I do like the fact it's got a hood. I mean, you can see that's still quite oversized. So hence why I sized right down in it. Um, but it's got beautiful pockets. I love the fact that the pockets are ribbed and so are the bottom of the sleeves. I just think it adds a really nice extra detail to it. It's a really, really nice length. And it's just nice and chunky, nice and warm, nice and cozy. I just think it looks really nice in this type of outfit. So, and then I just teamed it with some white chunky trainers. So yeah, right. And then I'll show you a jacket that I've also got. So the jacket is from River Island and the jacket is probably my new favorite thing ever. It is just me in a jacket. I am obsessed with it. So it's like that faux leather material, but a trench coat. So I, I wear a trench coat every year. I have worn them ever since I was about 17. I've been obsessed with trench coats. <laughs> and this one, oh my god, I love it. So I've got a size 8, it's got roll up sleeves. Um, I think you could probably roll them down, but then they'll be a little bit long. So that's the perfect, perfect length. Um, it hasn't got a button, which actually I prefer. I hate doing a coat up. And then it's got little metal zips here and really cute pockets. But my favourite thing, actually I've got two favourite things about this. No, I haven't, I've got three. <laughs> one is the colour, one is the length it's really nice and long and I love things that are long but it is this detail around the waist this is ruched waistline here and here just makes it so so flattering so this is a size 8 I probably could have got away with a bit smaller but it depends what you're going to wear with it I like things really fitted I don't like them loose and um, so I'll just show you the back this is the back so yeah, I think that is probably one of my favourite ever coats. It's also got the little lapels on the top as well. So yeah, this is going to be probably on my body a lot. <laughs> I'll be wearing this 
all the time. I'm obsessed with it. So I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. If you did, don't forget to give it a quick thumbs up and don't forget to leave a positive comment below. Let me know which look you like the best. Was it jeans number one, jeans number two, number three or number four? And then I would absolutely love it if you subscribed for more videos. Thanks so much for watching, guys. See you soon. Bye.